Today, I'm gonna reveal Jamie's deepest, darkest secrets. Hi, Sody family. <laughs> Welcome to the Sody Show. I wasn't ready for that one. I forgot I was supposed to do the jingle. <laughs> I forgot about the jingle. And that's my deepest, darkest secret. That's the se most secretive thing I have in my whole life. But Jamie, on the other hand. I don't have any, so I don't know what you're saying. You know the secrets I'm about to share, right? They're lies, so. First of all. <laughs> any secret that he If you haven't even heard it yet, how do you say it's I a lie? I know that it's a lie, because I, any secret that he shares, they're all lies they're I'm made like up. James, or not James Bond, George Washington. James Bond. James Bond might lie sometimes, he's a spy. But hmm. That's his job. But George Washington, I don't, I would never tell a lie. I just don't think that I have any deepest darkest Do you have anything you want to share about yourself before we start this little conversation starter? I don't, so I don't know what, I don't. Okay, so. What? You have to t admit whether these things are true or false when I tell your secrets. The entirety of it? Or are you gonna embellish things? What does that even mean? Because that's what you do is you embellish things. Like Name one time I've ever done that. Every single time, everything. Like I could tell you a story about myself and then like it'll come up, you'll share my story to other people and then it's like 90% false. Okay, well let's let you guys be the judges of this because I don't think that's the case. When Jamie and I were dating. Oh gosh. And this is pretty serious stuff. <laughs> you don't just marry somebody. You have to ask them, what's the worst thing they've ever done? So dumb. The worst thing- I didn't thing... ever even ask you what the worst thing you've ever done was. Thank goodness. It sounds like you know where this is going. <laughs> I didn't want to know. Jamie knows where this is going because it is a secret. And it wasn't even you asking me what the worst thing you've ever done. It was just like us talking. No, I asked that question. I said, what's the worst thing you've ever done? He's gonna lie about it, so. And she said that <laughs> she went and <laughs> defecated on a soccer field. Now, I that's not all the way true. The whole because she lie. ended up wussing out and not doing it, so she stayed in the car while her team defecated on an opposing team's soccer field. Still a lie. Can we know what team? What field? Basic. Oh, so oh, okay, that makes sense. A lie, but she has an exact location. And she claims it's that so that's not how she told me the story, it's not but I it. have a distinct memory. He just has a, the worst memory. Of did, you de I know. did you defecate beforehand and bring it to the soccer field? Or no, they went and squatted on, in, right? There was the no poop involved. Whoa, we don't say that word on YouTube. In the video at all. Can we be careful with our language? Or in the story at all. Okay, I, you're just lying, so. It's not a lie. That is what you told me your deepest, darkest secret was. Okay, so you're telling me to tell, tell them if it's a lie or true, it's a lie. Okay, then what's a lie about what, my, what you told me the story was? Okay, the story was. I had a soccer sleepover at a friend's house, the entire team. It was like this bonding moment before we went and played. Well, that's a weird thing to bond playoffs. over. Jared, do you bond over? Can I tell my story? Defecation with your friends? Honestly, I no, can't I even tell my tell story you without I'm you just... like interrupt. See, he tells the stories for me. Wrong. And so we had a sleepover and we decided let's go toilet paper. The opposing teams, like our opposing kind of the team that we kind of like had beef with. Your I rival guess. teams. Our rival team. There's only one. And so. I was saying teams place, like was an apostrophe. They're filled. Yes. And so we so grabbed a bunch of toilet paper. So he leaves out the toilet paper part, but I think his brain misfires when I told the story. And so he's thinking toilet paper, when do I use toilet paper? Oh, this. He leaves out no. toilet paper in the field completely. No. So we get a bunch of toilet paper, we use it, We. Grab all the toilet paper from this girl's house. Wait, we did go you get say you more. use it? No. We grab it. We all get in a car or two cars and we drive. See how the story And just we're getting out to toilet paper and I stay inside because <laughs> I'm too scared to do it. So the worst thing you ever did, you didn't do. That no. was my first comment. And it was toilet papering a field, a soccer okay, field. Toilet papering a field. Like, that's not a thing people do. You don't toilet paper grass. Uh, you do in Nevada, so... That's something that happened a lot. My Jared? house got toilet papered. House? I mean, luckily. the house got toilet papered. House? Okay, you, okay, we can't go toilet paper players' houses. I don't know where they live, so we did their field. Their school you could do, but you just laid toilet paper on the ground. We just shredded so toilet just paper everywhere. littered. Yes, everywhere. I didn't do it. That's actually illegal. That's way worse okay. than defecating on the well, ground. I'm that's pretty fine. sure that's illegal, In Vegas, too. from what I hear. So... <laughs> 
You tell the story wrong, but I didn't do it. You swear to me that you didn't tell me at I least swear. a Why story would I say that? about somebody defecating on a field? Because no, I, I, I didn't make that up. It didn't happen. Maybe one of the girls were joking about, oh, I have toilet paper, maybe I'll poop on the lawn, but I, we were toilet papering. Would you stop using the P word, please? And you're saying that I did it. I said that you didn't. That we weren't going there to do that. It was to toilet paper, the opposing field. Mm. So, so is that really an embarrassing story? No. Jared, which story sounds more realistic? More realistic would be toilet papering. But <laughs> I mean, thank you. I mean, you really I feel like I mean, ones. one of them does sound kind of gross. <laughs> yeah, one of them for a bunch of girls to do. But well, I wouldn't put it past Jamie's soccer team not see? doing that. But, but I didn't do it. Hmm, but she didn't do it. So her most embarrassing and her worst thing she ever did. It wasn't embarrassing. Was I didn't participate. Something she didn't participate in. It was scary. Were your teammates mocking you for not doing it? Or were they like, whatever, we're out? No, I just stayed in and then another person also stayed in with me. Oh, I'll stay with her. I was like, I'm not going out there. I'm not doing that. <laughs> Why didn't you want to go do it? I, I am actually curious about this. Because she actually had a love for that other team. I Because you didn't want to be worried. a basic girl? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so I was there? worried that they would have, like, cameras. I didn't want to part Get of it. Get caught? Yeah. And then... After there was like so you a would let your whole team burn and us. you would be like, I'm cool though. I'd be like, I wasn't, I didn't do that. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <sighs> Interesting. If, if your team got in trouble, would you be a snitch? Would you have snitched? If they came to you and If said, they would have gotten in trouble, they're already in trouble. If so. they would have come to you and be like, hey. No, if they didn't know who it was. Your team might have toilet papered basics field. Would you have been like, yeah, it was her, 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 and her? No, I don't think I would have said that. What would you have said? I would have been like, I didn't do that. I wasn't there. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't go on the field and toilet paper. I don't know what, don't you're, know what talking you're talking about. about. What you talking about, Willis? I don't know what you're talking about. All right, well, that's... And if they had cameras, they would not see me there. That's not a great deep, dark secret. I have, a, I have actually embarrassing. more for Jamie, but I'm going to let Jamie take a shot at you me. have more for me? Oh, more I have a fake lot. fake ones? We shall see. Okay, so are we doing deep, dark secrets? Are we most doing... embarrassing secrets. This isn't clickbait. We're telling our most embarrassing secrets. Okay. Uh-oh. Um... Why did she get a little sparkle in her I eye? Did. When she just... She, I didn't... I, she still has it. I did. Jared, does she look a little too excited about this? Yeah, just a little bit. Or are you, like, going thumbing through a million different... I think she's trying to figure out which think. one to use. I don't know if I've ever been embarrassed in my life. You haven't? Well, it hasn't been told to millions of people that are watching this podcast either. So. <laughs> millions of people who are watching this podcast. Millions and millions. I don't know about embarrassing. Billions and billions of Or a of secret, but we viewers. haven't really talked about this. Steve was engaged before. So he's been engaged multiple times in his life. Is that embarrassing? Yeah, I'm kind of embarrassed Is by that, that kind of embarrassing? I'm a little embarrassed by and that. I, and I, I think he got engaged pretty quickly after meeting this person. So it was a pretty quick yeah. engagement. So that would be that could be something that could be kind of embarrassing. It was kind of embarrassing. And I'm not embellishing anything. It's worse that anytime it's brought up, like we were watching a show and they're like, it's not like I've been engaged more than one time. The father of the bride or whatever. Yes. It's not like he's been engaged ever before. I was like. Talking about the red flags of the person yeah, that she's dating. Like, uh, it's not like he's been engaged multiple times. Like, or get, been engaged And Jamie's just like. <laughs> So is that a thing? Like, that's, is that an embarrassing thing when you're like, I've been engaged more than once? Probably. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't usually be the... I'm not bringing it up. You're not telling people? Who is? Me. Oh. Same with you telling people that I'm lying, that telling my story. Is lying. Jamie embarrassed by that fact? No. I'm not. I'm telling people, so I would think I would think that if you were embarrassed, you wouldn't like. No. And it, I'm not telling like random people. It's like if it gets brought up or someone's saying, it's like, oh, well, Steve's engaged. The embarrassing before. part of the story though is that while I was engaged, is when me and Jamie started dating. Right. Just kidding. That's not, not true. That's not true. That that's is not a, true at all. I, that's a lie. I don't want millions and millions and millions. So like of you guys are millions. hiding something. Over there. Nope. So I would say that's kind of it. Could be embarrassing. That was pretty embarrassing. But not quite as embarrassing as this next story. Sure. We'll see. 
Okay, well, I've got a couple. Do I need to push pause so that you can think? <laughs> no, no. He has to process in his brain. He has to compile it right because... I like to enjoy... He'll remember. ...a well. good night's sleep. I love it. This one's true. <laughs> and woke up one night. It was probably summertime. And I am just sopping wet. And I'm like, I can't believe I'm sweating this much when I'm sleeping. What did I eat? Like, what is happening? I can't believe I don't feel good. You do sweat when you sleep. Sometimes. And Jamie jumps up. I peed the bed! And that's when I knew. Ew. I had been... I emptied my entire bladder. Bathed in Jamie's bladder juice. You know, sometimes... That is absolutely foul. That sometimes I catch disgusting. it. Disgusting. And because I'm a bigger fellow, <laughs> it puddled. Yeah, I mean, he had all the weight. And maybe I'm the one who should be embarrassed by this story, <laughs> but... I was fine. It just kind of puddled... She had like a little tiny bit back. in her underwear or whatever, and I'm <laughs> sopping wet. Okay, so With I have peaches. bladder, I have bladder issues, major bladder Bladder issues. Is that what you're about to say? <laughs> Were you about to say bladder No, but if there's such a thing, gonna say bladder if there's such a thing, I have it. I have bladder <laughs> and if I drink specifically water oh, so at yeah. any like Thought past, we're getting into some more deeper darker no, secrets. if I drink water past like five o'clock. I struggle at night, and if I'm too deep, I'm dreaming that I am running from bathroom to bathroom, toilet to toilet, and don't tell me you guys don't have these dreams. Oh, of course I have that. Where you're like, it's... But then I wake up and use the restroom. I wake up 17 times when I have to pee. So bad that I didn't wake up, and I just, that time, and there's several times that I have peed the bed, but I didn't ever do it before having kids. How many times have you peed the bed this year? None. Okay, I was like, wait a minute. None. This was a few so years ago. So this isn't, this isn't were, a comment. Were you pregnant at the I time? I was pregnant, yeah. so I also have Give issues when I'm pregnant because your bladder Baby's is kicking being right pushed in the bladder. on it. I already have an issues with bladder. I think I have a small bladder, and then you're pregnant, the baby's pushing on it. So I was pregnant at the time, So, but I didn't ever have issues with bedwetting. I wasn't a kid that had bedwetting problems. I don't think you were either, Jared. Yeah, and then no, we didn't I have bedwetting problems. You had peeing your pants problems, though. Yes, from laughing. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'll just pee. <laughs> but being asleep. That's, that's why I'm asking. How many times asleep, have you peed this year? Being asleep at night. I haven't. She talks haven't about peeing her pants enough? so much that peeing. Nothing's been funny this year. Pee my pants is one oh, word for Jamie. Nothing's been funny. Pants. What pee a boring I'm going to pee my pants. <laughs> Stop it. I'm going to pee my pants. But adulthood was where I had the issue after having babies. How did I handle getting urinated all over? Fine. I don't remember being... I did the laundry. I think that was fine. How did does I, someone I handle that? Did I shower or did I just go back to bed? Like, what did we I, do? You know, I'm... I don't know. I would hope you showered. I just kind of like did. brushed it off. And then <laughs> <laughs> I think covered I, it with some newspaper. Pulled out the it's squeegee usually, from underneath the bed. It's usually and happening. It that one I think was morning time. Yeah, it was daytime. I think when I it woke up. It was a little bit. Or it wasn't like in the middle of the night. It's happened in the middle of the night before when I was pregnant, but it was mostly not, it wasn't pooling on you. So it was like, kind of like picking up some of the sheets, rolling it, trying to clean it up. This one pooled on me. But. That, you might've peed hours before. No, I think. Cause I think it was like juicy. Like I was like sponging it up in my body. Probably. I am now made up of some of your urine. He was soaking it. <laughs> Jared's face. I was marinating in that stuff all night long. That one was. So that's what soaking is. <laughs> that was the grossest one, probably. So, are yeah. you embarrassed by that? I'm not. Hmm. I'm not embarrassed by it. Shoot. Fine. We're going to let Jamie have another stab about it. Um, if you can think of anything else that I could possibly be embarrassed by. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, because I've never done anything embarrassing. There's been plenty of things that you embarrassed. <laughs> Embarrassing. Um, are you <laughs> Oh, no. I don't want to be No. Mean. What are you? Why did you? <laughs> so. When she gets that excited, it's scary. No, for me. I don't. Is it embarrassing to have, to like almost oh. have your bachelor's degree, but like have <laughs> literally one class, one project of one class? Like so, mine is one like I even one thought I had it. I just didn't pass my project credits. in my class. Yeah, that's a little embarrassing. Where it's like, I've done all the work. Did the graduation parties. Gra walked. Gra walked in the graduation. 
just to find out. Yes. But I didn't do it, and then I was like, yeah, I'm not going back. Yeah, so he's like minus three credits or something. Yeah. I don't even know what it comes I actually down to. looked into it this year, and they were like, yeah, it's been over 10 years. <laughs> You're going to have to retake a bunch of classes now. You're not three credits away anymore. And I was like, I better call the University of Phoenix. And if you're looking for a brand deal, UOP, Harvard of the online (laughs) universities, I am ready. It is kind of embarrassing. It's more embarrassing. But you pretty much just say you got, like. I don't say that to most people. It depends on, no, I'm saying like. I should. I have a degree. But a lot of people don't ask. Like nowadays people aren't like, what did you get a degree in? Usually it's what do you do for a living or, you know, stuff like that. It's not like, what did you go to school for when you're in your 40s? Yeah. It's true. And so it's one of those things that, like, it's I don't a, know. I know. I'm it's embarrassed. Like you did I'm embarrassed I didn't do it. Though. All of the work to even doing the project. I'm, I'm a little embarrassed project. by that one. I, I wish I would have finished that up. Regrets. <laughs> so, next question. I'm not going to just state something embarrassing about you. I want to know uh, what you actually are embarrassed by. What would you say is, besides I, who you married, to, besides who to, you married, you can't use that. What's the most embarrassing now thing? Now I have to pick something on myself. That You're not you telling are stories of me. I'm switching it up. I switched the game up right now, mid game. I don't like that. Now you're, no, you're, now you're making me come up with more. Are um, you? Is there something that you're like, this is embarrassing to me? I'm trying to think. Like, there are things that happened, like, I, I know when I was younger where I was like, oh, that was embarrassing when I was like. Like, what's something that happened to you in, like, school that you were like. Okay, so in junior she high. She got her first F. That wasn't embarrassing to me. Driver's Ed? Nope. Interesting. Why would Driver's Ed be embarrassing? You got a D in it. Yeah, because they lost my papers. Mm hmm. Asked my mom. All the fake stories. I did the worst. I turned in all these papers and they But that's not it. it. What's the embarrassing thing that happened to you? The most, Im- like in school, junior high is stressful being a kid in junior high already. And I hated PE like every kid. Um, and our PE teacher was PE weird. was the best. What do you mean you hated did you have, PE? Did you have Miss Whitehead? Jared had some embarrassing no, had some stories like I was at the new school. I was at Minion. Okay, school. you have very embarrassing yeah. stories. Okay. I do have very embarrassing <laughs> stories. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't about me. In school. But <laughs> PE was fun. I liked PE. Right. I liked PE, but I didn't like the whole lockers and changing aspect of it. But I had a weird teacher. But I needed to change after having PE into my clothes to go to school. And you're given, you know, a certain amount of time, the bell rings, whatever, but I'm changing and you're trying to be discreet, whatever. But I like slide off my gym shorts and I'm like, and I'm trying to put on my pants and I'm pulling my pants up and I'm like, um, I didn't take my shoes off, my tennis shoes off. And you're stuck in your and own pants. And I'm half. stuck in my own pants. With your booty hanging out. Kind of. With the cooter and the scooter sticking out. <laughs> that was... Disturbing. So I was trying to pull, they were pretty much up, but one leg, like I was able to, I was pulling and I'm sweating, my face is red and I'm like pulling and I got one pant leg through. And this is the time I think where the pant legs were a little thinner at the bottom. They had to have been. No bell bottoms going on here. No. And I got my pant leg up and I'm working on the other leg and I'm, and the bell has rang and everyone's leaving and I'm like, I'm stuck. And you're sitting there. I'm stuck with my pa- my shoe stuck in my Crack pants. Crack in the air. No. <laughs> I, Maybe you. And I'm sitting there. What? And everyone's leaving, and I'm like, I can't leave like uh, this. And then another class is going to come in. I'm going to be late. I was also super scared to be late for classes. I was never late. And there was this girl that I was like, help me. I finally was like, please help me. And she's like, I gotta go. And I'm like, no, please. And we both were tugging. Finally she stopped and we were able like to get my pant leg up all over my shoe and I sprinted to class, but it was, embarrassing. it was a, a moment where I was like, just the, the things flashing through my head to me. Like, I was like, I can't walk to class with my pants half down. I can't, I'm gonna be stuck She's here. like, I'm not going to be late. So I will go. No, <laughs> but I'm like, I'll sit here, but I'm like, I can't sit here and no yeah. class is coming in. I'm just sitting here stuck with my shoe in my pants. That would have been tough. Never, ever try to That's pretty embarrassing. speed things up by putting your pants over that shoes. That is pretty embarrassing. 
was. Not as embarrassing as my junior high story, though. <laughs> so that's the most embarrassing you've ever been? No, I, no, I just I mean, came up with or just one, one in school. Yeah. That's pretty embarrassing, though. That was embarrassing. I had, that reminded me of so a junior high, all this urination talk and this oh, gosh. school talk. I was in a new school. I was young. I was scared. I'm trying to justify this. And I was too scared to ask to use the restroom like a kindergartner, except for I was in like seventh grade. <laughs> what? Don't tell me you peed your pants at school. <laughs> and I, you know, was in a cool time. So I was wearing like some black baggy pants. So it worked out fine for me. Did you wet yourself in seventh grade? I peed my pants. In seventh grade? Science class. Puddle on the ground. No. Literally puddle You're on Jordan's the ground. You're Jordan's age. Literally <laughs> puddle on the ground. The part of that is that it, it was on purpose. I, yeah, I just, well, I mean, like it just, was, but I Instead had a of just going out. I was old enough to have a choice. I just freaked out. Because you didn't want to ask? Yeah, I was scared or something. I don't know what was going on. I must have been traumatized. And I left a puddle on the ground in my science class and just went to my next class and did the rest of my day. In my sopping wet pants that no one could tell though because they're black. And it was great. The poor next class that came and I, in. I probably got myself a good little rash from that, but. Oh my gosh. It was. That's so gross. Pretty. I know. What if someone came in there? It had to have happened. Like, what's on the ground here? Teacher knows who sat there. <laughs> you would smell the rest of the day. I mean, it's junior high. They all smell. I mean, if you walked into a junior high, no offense, junior high people, it stinks in your schools. It's true. And that's why I was embarrassed. You feed yourself in school. Anyways, thanks for watching our embarrassing podcast. That was super embarrassing for you. Maybe I shouldn't have fessed up to that. I know, you had, I would say you got more embarrassing stories than I did. If we don't hurry up, I might do it again right here. Thank you guys for watching today's video. Make sure you subscribe and click that bell so that you can get notifications when we post awesome videos like this one. Give us a big thumbs up and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.